Hi guys, this is Daniel from FND. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use blend feature and imagine feature in Merge Journey to blend two or more images to create a generated images. In this video, we are going to see the merits and demerits of blend feature and imagine feature. So let's get started. The blend feature is used to blend two or more images to create a new A generated image from that reference images. To use blend feature, you need to type slash blend and click on enter. And you can see it will ask you to drop image one and image two. You need to have minimum two images to blend and you can blend up to five images. You can drag and drop or click to upload the image file first i'm going to blend two images this one and this one let's see how the mid journey gives the output then click on enter now you can see the result over here so you can see the warrior and that house so these are the four images so this is using the blend feature we get these images you can also use the imagine feature and copy those links let's see what output images the mid journey gives we are using the same two images that we used for blend and the output which are generated are more or less looking the same this one is generated using blend feature and this one is using imagine feature so the results are looking same let's see how to blend five images so type in slash blend enter and add your first image second one and to add third image you need to press over here and click on image 3 and add your image so I'm going to add this one to add a fourth image click on here image 4 I'm going to add this one and image 5 and click on enter let's see how the mid journey gives the output so this is the output the mid journey gives so you can see it is not looking good so using five different images without any prompt and using blend feature it is not going to give the perfect results let's reduce with four different images here i'm going to remove that helmet image i'm going to do that again blend and these are the four images i'm going to blend and click on enter and these are the results using four different images and using blend feature you can see the water house and the person so here you can see there is no person so it is not giving the perfect results as you like so instead of using blend option we can directly use uh, imagine option and you have more control by using the prompts in blend option we can't use prompts while in imagine option we can use prompts so i'm gonna copy the same images I'm going to use the imagine command, paste those image URLs and add a space and you can type in your prompt. So using the imagine command, I just added those four images and also added the prompt. So we have more control using imagine command while using blend command. We can only add images. You can't add prompts to it. So I'm going to enter to see what the mid journey gives so you can see the results over here you have more control of what you need so you can see the viking person and also boat and the lake and you can see it is not giving that house so if you want you can add that house in the prompt so i'm going to copy the same using this imagine command and add house enter let's see how it's giving the result and you can see the results 
so it is giving that house but not the boat on this image you can see the boat and the house here and you can see the house here but you can see the boat and the house over here so you can have more control uh, using imagine command instead of a blend command so blend command will give random images if you are using two images you can definitely use blend image but using more than two images you can use imagine command and you can also attain different art style using blend let's create one image slash imagine i'm going to create cyberpunk background so i like this one i'm going to download that upscale to also i'm going to upscale this one u4 and i'm going to download it also download this image so now let's try to blend these two images the cyberpunk style and this one slash blend first i'm going to select this viking man next one the cyberpunk click on enter now you can see the results so this is how it looks so you can get some decent images by blending two different styles now i'm going to blend these two images let's see we can get this sketch art style and you can see the results and you can see the warrior and pretty much it is converted to this uh, art style so this is how we can use blend feature and imagine feature to blend two or more images if you want to blend two images you can use blend feature if you want to blend more than two images you can use imagine feature in the imagine feature you can add prompts but in the blend feature you can't add prompts so using the imagine feature you you can have more control and you can specify which part or style you need from the reference image so that's it this is how we can use blend feature and imagine feature to blend two or more images so thanks for watching if you like this video give thumbs up subscribe the channel for more future tutorials also press the bell icon so that you can get instant notification when i upload a video thanks for watching and bye